before I start on part three of the Lethal Weapon series, a few facts and figures. First off, the first movie had a budget of 15 million, which is absolutely fuck all, even back in the 1980s when it was made, 87, 86. That is still a low, low budget for a movie. Mel Gibson was only known for doing the Mad Max franchise. That's all he was known for. Danny Glover, never heard of. Um, most of the people in these films were unheard of. So um, even Gary Bussey, who's a known name now at the time, wasn't known for anything. So they had a £15 million budget. They made 120 at the box office. Now the box office does not include DVD sales, subscription charges, subscription didn't exist back then, or other revenue, like selling off to TV stations or whatever. That only accounts for the box office, which is generally the first month in the cinema. So it made nearly 10 times what it cost. Part two, double the budget, 30 million. They made 227.9 million at the box office. This is just domestic box office, which means just in America, which means just in North of America in a month. That's a substantial profit nearly 10 times, probably about seven to eight times the budget. Third one, only slightly higher, 35 million pounds budget for part three, but it made 321 million. That's close to 10 times the budget. The fourth one, kind of like the last gasp because it was supposed to be the final, 1998, which is quite scary because the last one was 1998 when Mortal would have been in his 60s, 24 years ago. I did a quick look and part five has got a rumoured Mel Gibson starring in it and Danny Glover, who's going to be in his 80s. Actually, no, no, yeah, 80s, 90s. He's going to be in his 80s or 90s. That should be interesting. But part four had a budget. You see where you get a little bit cagey when it comes to budgets because the late 90s are getting more and more about hiding what they're paying. So the budget is estimated between 100 and 150 million, which is between three and 13 times the budget of the previous movie. And, um, they made they made two hundred eighty five million, but so they're, they're making double the budget, between two and three times the budget in profit, which is a substantial amount. It's over a hundred million pounds at dollars profit. But you got to bear in mind that that budget is going on wages because you can guarantee, at this stage in the game, after doing three successful movies, highly profitable movies that Mel Gibson, Danny Glover as well, they're going to be getting paid big fucking bucks. They're going to be getting paid at least 20% of the budget is their wages. But um, they're good movies, all good movies. Third and fourth are not as good as the first two, but they're still good. 